All right, so I'll begin the video by letting you know I did not receive this product from the company for free, and they are not uh, actually promoting me or paying me to do this video. I just thought it would be fun. So um, this is LED grow lights. Now I want to start grow growing some seedlings in the house. I do have grow lights, but it's a real pain in the butt. I have GE bulbs, and you had to like uh, actually screw them into uh you know, like lamps and then the lamps are like, uh, they ended up, uh, being a problem because the grow light bulbs are so large. And when you screw them into a standard, uh, like socket lamp, it gets overheated with the shade and then they tip over and whatnot. So I got these and, uh, actually this, uh, actually is a really, really heavy duty box. Um, this is actually, you know, I thought it would be like some cheap chintzy lightweight thing. But uh, I'm going to really fast show you on Amazon um, the actual product. There'll be a link in the description below for it, actually. And uh, I'm going to tell you the features. We're going to open it up and we're going to check it out and actually see what it's all about. Okay, so this particular product is being sold on Amazon for $39.98. And uh, I got it, actually, for so much cheaper. I ended up paying... $14.94 for it. Now that doesn't mean you're going to end up paying $14.94 for it. You will probably have to pay the full price of $39.88. If this uh, coupon is still available, um, here is the code. And uh, I'm not supposed to be doing this. This is a, a site that's free for all of you to sign up on. It's called snagshout.com. S-N-A-G-S-H-O-U-T.com. And you just sign up with your email address. You give them your phone. You might not want to give them your phone number, but they have to text you like a one-time code to get you, you know, to know that it's you. And once you use a, a snag, it's called snagging something. Um, I'll show you an example of a snag. Um, here we go. Hold on. All right. So products will pop up if my computer will move quick. And for example, all sorts of things will pop up. Say you want this, you click on it and then it says snag it. So you click on snag. Once you use your snag, you, uh, lose it. So they give you sometimes like they'll start you out with like five snags and each snag that you use gets minus and depleted. But they end up after like, I think five to seven days, you get replenished again with snags. Um, so, all right. So back to that particular item. So I ended up getting it for, uh, 13, actually $14 and 94 cents. I snagged it. It says 20 here, but what's really great is if, uh, Amazon seller actually has a coupon with the item you'll also get that discount off of the full price so if it's 39.99 and it says 30 percent off um it's like another uh you know i suck at math what is that ten dollars off or nine dollars off if um something is a hundred dollars and it says um fifty dollar coupon on the actual listing on Amazon, um, it'll actually take $50 off plus the additional coupon from Snagshout, which ended up being $20 and then minus the seller's coupon, brought it down to $14.94, which is absolutely unbelievably awesome. So what features does it have? Okay, so somebody is knocking on my door. It's 2.09 a.m. Hold on a minute. Okay, I got scared shitless because someone was knocking on my door at 2.09 a.m. It turns out it's my a uh, teenage daughter who didn't have a house key. She couldn't find it. All right. So back to the product. Now, if you have an attention span of a flea, I know you're going to hit the back button, but if you're into growing plants and stuff like that, um, here is the product It actually telescopes and gets bigger, which is great. So it's a five head light. So there's five different lights. I don't know if you could see that there. There's like little wands on a gooseneck that you can bend into all different positions. Okay, so it's uh, actually 360 degree adjustable gooseneck, like I showed you. It's a gooseneck bendable type of deal. Um, it has three lighting modes, red and blue, red and blue and warm white light and warm white light. 10 levels of brightness settings. And the brightness can be switched between 10% to 100% at will. So depending upon your needs and the different stages of plant growth, 
uh, growth, you can do that. Now, it also has a timer setting with a remote control. So um, it's also the uh, settings and the controls is also on the plug, but also separately on a remote control. So you can set it for four hours, eight hours, or a 12-hour uh, timer setting, which can be turned off every day according to the time you set. It also allows you to work or travel without worrying about your plant you know, not getting enough light. So you can set it and forget it. Okay, so it has high efficiency, full spectrum uh, LED bulbs. So it has uh, three lighting mo mo uh, modes, again, red and blue, which promotes plant growth, flowering and fruiting. Um, that's interesting. Um, then we had the red and blue and warm light, which enhances the red and blue light on the basis of natural light and effectively promotes growth of plants. Um, and now, last but not least, we have the warm white light, which just sim simulates sunlight. So it promotes seed growth and promotes chlorophyll synthesis. Um, here we go. So we have, um, it shows you here the differences between the different colors. So again, the red and blue light promotes plant growth, flowering, and fruit. The warm uh, light simulates sunlight and improves the seedling growth. So if you have seedlings, that's really good for it. There we go. And then last but not least, we have red, blue, and warm light. And that enhances red and blue light based on natural light, which effectively promotes growth. And that made absolutely no sense at all. But then again, what makes sense? I have no clue. All right, so here we go. It's showing you a before and then an after um, using these lamps. And uh, it shows you various uh, states, of, uh, states of growth. Um, before, so if you want to ripen tomatoes even and do it indoors, and this is after using the light. Um, again, we have different levels of heights. So we have um, different levels and heights of plants and herbs and um, all sorts of uh, natural things you can grow. Yes, and even the funky stuff, if you know what I mean. We had the flexible gooseneck, the adjustable height with the clips, the aluminum tripod stand, and 150 high quality LED lights. Um, all right, so let's get it opened. Let's check it out. And uh, let's actually, we'll turn the lights out in the house and we'll see what colors, uh, you know, the kitchen turns. All right, let's get this open. And again, I'm very um, surprised at the weight of it. It has weight to it. And okay, so it's packed really nice. It appears that we have a uh, you know, some kind of uh, information on how, you know, tips, how to get this started. Um, on the back, it shows you how to operate the remote control and how to build it. <laughs> and I don't like building things. I'll be completely honest with you. All right. So we got the remote control and always these remote controls actually have a little tab. I don't know if you could see that right on the end, a clear uh, tab. You got to pull it out in order to activate the batteries. So if you're going to say, oh, the remote doesn't work, well, that's why. Okay, so here's the plug, which is actually, wow, this is a thick plug. Let's check this out. I'm very surprised. Look how thick this plug is. This is actually amazing. All right, so we have the control also on the plug. And here we go. That's uh, the goosenecks and the LED lights. And then we have a wall, a wall charger. And so this plugs in, it looks like a USB and it plugs into the wall charger. Okay. Oh yeah, there we go. Regular USB. And then we have the tripod right over here. And I'm going to build it and I'll be right back actually. Let's just put everything in the box and we'll get to it. Okay. So to build it, um, you have to open up the tripod and let's try to do that. Okay. So it basically folds out and I'm having a little bit of an issue. Here we go. Okay. So, all right. All right. So you open up the tripod. Let me just put that down. Okay. And now what do you do? Um, it has some kind of like little pivoting thing on the top and reading instructions is not my favorite thing to do in the world. Let's see, where would this hook up? Where would this hook up? Hmm. I don't see, oh, okay. There is something in the center here. It looks like some kind of screw. So I think this cap might come off. <laughs> Let's see, again, I should be reading instructions. All right, so it looks like a little bolt right here. All right, and we got the hole right in the center. Let's see if that works. Hopefully it will. 
and let me just lock this in place oh okay all right the stand actually yeah hold on it goes all the way down all right now let me just lower my stand to try to show you this because a lot of people complain when i do these uh videos they're like well why didn't you show us how to build it why didn't you do this why didn't you do that and uh, I, and then I, I feel like bad because then, you know, I'm not going to give people a good uh, understanding of the product. Okay, so basically, I believe that this gets screwed into here. And let's see if that is actually what happens. Hold on. And I should be reading the instructions. Let's get this damn chair out of the way. And I'll be back. Actually, I'll be back. Whoa, whoa, I almost just fell. Okay, so the tripod on the bottom, um, down here, I had it flat before, but you can actually raise it up and down, and then it has a, a, a locking or a tightening like screw on the very bottom. So there we go, I have it like this now. And uh, on the bottom of the pole and all along the uh, shaft of the pole, it has little tightening uh, screws so you can raise and lengthen or shorten the pole height. And then you can tighten it, tighten it and lock it in place. So once you screw the uh, LED lights into the uh, you know top part of the uh, pole, um, now it's just time to spread them out. And so you can spread them out in all different ways, all, um, all different directions. Um, you can have one going this way, one going that way. Um, you can actually turn this around and you can spread this out and do whatever basically you want with it, which is pretty cool. Um, so there we go. And uh, yeah, so however you want to angle it is up to you. All right, so now I'm going to plug it in um, actually to the charger. And uh, we're going to see the colors. We're going to check this out. So let's see what happens. Okay, so it's not fully extended, but you can see like the size of this thing. And uh, this is actually really, really cool. Look at that. There we go. All right, so I'm going to turn it on. I'm going to plug it into the uh, wall charger and I'm going to shut all the lights out. Okay, so, so far the only thing I'm really not liking about it is that the cord isn't as long as I'd like it to be. I mean, it's actually long enough for most people, but um, I'm going to just get an extension cord. And uh, so I can, you know, have it uh, actually reach because if I have it right here, it's not going to re uh, reach my plug if, say, I wanted to have my plant in this area. So, um, be you know, keep in mind that you might just need an extension cord. The cord is actually about five feet long, if that helps, um, you know, any of you out there. And I can't shut this off. Oh, here we go. So all the lights are out in my kitchen. I have just the... Uh, you know, light in the other room on. All right, so how do we turn this on? Let's try this. And, ah, okay. So I don't even have to touch. Here's the uh, control panel. I don't even actually have to touch that, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know how to set the timer. I'm not gonna show you guys how to set the timer because um, I don't feel like it. I'm a little lazy. I mean, it's really actually, it looks like it's a, you don't have to be a rocket scientist to figure this one out, but here we go. All right, so let's check out, actually, hang in there. Um, let's check out this remote. Okay, so brightness. Let's, uh, I'm going to shut the light off, actually, in the other room. Hold on one second. Okay, so now we're in utter darkness. And let's play around with the remote. Okay, so brightness. And I'm amping up the brightness. Now I'm going to lower the brightness. And that's 10%. Now we're going to amp it up all the way to 100%. And let's play around with the colors. All right, so we got, I don't know what this little thing is right here. Let's press this button. And, oh, okay, it changes the color. So now it looks like warm white. And let's play with the brightness. So it's amped up, and let's lower it now. Okay, so now it's at the lowest. And we're going to amp it up again. There we go. And, okay, now we're at the brightest. I'm going to press that button again. And now we have this really cool psychedelic, almost like purple. Yeah, it's purple. Yeah, because blue and red makes purple. So it's uh, pretty cool. And we're going to lower the brightness a second to the lowest it can go. And amp it back up. 
Actually, this thing is freaking cool. You can actually uh, actually cover a lot, a lot, a lot of, um, yeah, let's take a look at this. You, you can uh, cover a lot, a lot of area with this. I'm very surprised. I bought two of these, actually. Okay, so we have right here another thing. I don't know what this is, so let's press it. Oh, okay, so now you don't have to have all the lights on. So now we have uh, two on and actually three off. Press it again. Now we have one. Now we have, uh, yeah, one on actually. The other was two. Now we have all of them on. And now we just have, I think, four on. Now it's three. Now it's two. And now it's one. All right. Okay, so we got them all back on now. Let's go to the brightest. Yes. What else do we got on here? Okay, and then we got the timer. And I don't know what this little moon thing means. Let's uh, check that out. I think that actually shuts the timer off. Okay, so what is my verdict on this? I'm telling you this is actually here. Let's pull back on here. This is awesome. And the fact that I only got it for like $16 and change. And then I did a sneaky thing uh, with Snag Shout. You're only allowed to use that coupon code once. But if you have a friend who has a Snag Shout account, like a family member, if you know what I mean, and they have a different telephone number to sign up with um, and a different email address that's not associated with you, you can actually snag the deal more than once, if you know what I mean. And I did. And uh, now I'm, another one is on its way. So now I have two of these. I can grow some like major shit inside my house. This is absolutely cool. Here, yeah, let's do a close up of the lights. And I hope nobody gets a migraine or a headache. There we go. And uh, I'm going to dim it. And I'm going to amp it back up. And uh, the cool part, hold on. So you can actually turn this in all different directions. So you can twist, you can actually twist it and have it face different ways. Um, trying to show you, there we go. You can turn this, you can aim it uh, different ways. You can uh, twist this in all different, um, you know, all different like types of uh, directions. You can have it facing actually completely up. Hold on. You can have it down, you can bend it this way, you can bend it that way. So this thing is absolutely amazing. I highly recommend it. Again, you might want to get an extension cord. Make sure you have one of those handy. Um, I'm just going to go back to my favorite color, which is the red and blue. <laughs> and uh, there we go. Yeah, because now we have a, a psychedelic purple uh, like little show going on. And again, you can actually make this really short. You can shorten it where it's as low as here. Um, to put it on a table, or you can actually make it go all the way as high as um, at least, actually it's not at its highest right now, it can even go higher than this. So if you have a really tall plant, um, there you go, like a, one of those big floor plants or indoor trees, this thing is just awesome. If you have things on a countertop, um, you can have this like, you know, like a, a really high up too, so it reaches the countertop. So yeah, I'm going to put a link in the description below. Will you get this for $16 and change? Probably not. The snack shout code is probably going to be gone um, and expired by the time you see this video. But would I pay the full price? Yes, definitely. I would definitely pay, uh, pay the full price. You want to grow veggies in your house. You want to grow funky herbs in your house. You want to grow um, all sorts of shit in your house. Uh, go ahead because this thing is going to start seedlings and it's going to keep established plants alive during even the winter. So yeah, I'm going to say this thing is a five star out of five star. There we go. So uh, again, in the description below will be the uh, link for it. I had fun building it and showing it to you guys. The timer, I don't feel like doing that right now. But what's also great is the fact that you got the remote control and you have the same exact functions built into this wire which is actually really quite heavy duty. Look at that. This is quality. This is a very, very uh, high quality unit. All right, guys, see you all soon. And uh, so long. There we go.